Hi there, can you hear me? Hello, me Tiku. Can you hear me? Let's just wait for one more minute to see if we have other people joining the call. Hey, Slava. Hi, hi. How are you? Yeah, I'm fine. So we have four people on the call. I, actually, it's three because uh, I'm locked in as both Ortho to record and as well as myself for audio <laughs> purposes. Uh, okay, okay. All right. Uh, I think let's just keep this quick. I'll jump right ahead to your updates, Slava. Mm -hmm. uh, let me start sharing my screen.
All right. Um, so how's it going in general with uh, infra and data sets and stuff? Yeah, so I think we are making progress and uh, we, uh, we actually harvested a lot of uh, data files, uh, almost 100,000 files uh, related to COVID-19. And uh, it's very important to uh, create a classification now and actually to classify all those uh, data sets and uh, mm -hmm. actually get uh, appropriate uh, groups task mm -hmm. groups to work with them because it's so many uh, so many information and data we already collected so yeah we, we need also to involve people uh, that uh, producing those data so uh, now we are approaching uh, data owners and we are asking uh, inviting them uh, actually to uh, do curation and uh, management of their own data sets and uh, surprisingly uh, we've got hey, like i'm i'm so sorry slava i think i lost you for a bit there okay so so what what we do now uh, we are Hello. yes can you hear me now hello can you hear me okay yeah i can hear you i think uh everything is fine as far as i see can you hear me yes i can hear you okay i uh, I don't know if it's my connection issue. I think I just lost you for a bit there. Um, I heard you at, um, we were looking to classify and group all the data uh, now, but I, I'm not sure what I missed after that. Okay, so uh, what we also do, we're approaching uh, people, actually data owners, and uh, we're mm -hmm. asking them if they're interested to curate and uh, do data management uh, on our dataverse. And uh, surprisingly, we got like 20% of uh, positive responses. So people really want to contribute their time. Oh, nice. and they, they can help us uh, actually to, uh, to create proper metadata for every file. And uh, I think at some point uh, it will be very clean uh, data lake that people can reuse and uh, they can just disconnect from their Jupyter notebooks and to start some, some, some kind of uh, data analysis. Amazing. That sounds yeah. good. Yeah, it sounds really cool. And uh, we'll try to uh, actually to uh, expand a little bit. So we will see if we can get uh, more results after we'll contact like 1,000 people. And uh, I hope it will be uh, the same. And uh, well, after we, we uh, enabled the data previewers, uh, our dataverse is, uh, is quite attractive because if you'll upload spreadsheet, you can already browse like, like in Google spreadsheets. And uh, mm -hmm. well, you don't need to download uh, files. You, 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 you can just uh, basically go from one data set to another data set and uh, find some interesting data for you. So I think awesome. we are moving in, in the right direction now. And uh, regarding task uh, of uh, Court 19 pipeline, we also have some progress. I think, uh, yeah, Lukas is not available today, but, but uh, he solved the problem with uh, entities uh, um, linked to uh, UMLS. UMLS, yes, yes. Yes. So we are going to try it and uh, I hope it will work in like in, in large pipelines. So we'll be able to do almost real time uh, entity recognition and uh, enrichment of uh, all entities. Awesome. Yeah. So regarding the next uh, task, we also we, we have some progress with Docano. Uh, so the problem because uh, yeah somehow we, we, we have uh, um, difficulties with Amazon uh, we are trying to enable a mail relay for a few weeks and uh, I don't know it didn't work so uh, mm -hmm. we tried to work around and uh, it seems uh, we can get some emails already and 
at the moment it's showstopper. So if we'll not manage to uh, finish this process this week, so probably we'll switch to another solution or we'll buy just external mail uh, server. Right, okay. Uh, sorry, I, I don't have too much context on that, but uh, this is for mailing, is it? Mailing subscription. Uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's for annotations. So it's um, for, it's basically to support NLP pipeline uh, and the idea that uh, we'll, we can get all, all entities recognized by uh, machine learning. And uh, we tested recently uh, our process that allows to get action in the Kana automatically. So basically it's, it looks really amazing because you, you can get uh, text uh, extracted from paper with highlighted uh, entities and uh, with different colors mm -hmm. indicating to what kind of uh, ontology uh, you can link and uh, the only uh, assignment of human just to prove that this is right choice. Ah, uh, okay. So we still have some, some small issues because it seems uh, it's not possible to get uh, large texts uh, supported by Dakana, but and, and also uh, mm -hmm. of course uh, mail functionality. But I think also we can manage to uh, finally start it like and introduce to all coronavirus users next week. Awesome! Awesome! Thanks, Lava. Uh, I have one quick question. Um, so uh, the uh, all the uh, data that we're ingesting from Git and um, that we're making available on Dataverse, do we have any stats of or any method of collecting stats for how many people are accessing them uh, yeah. and like, yes. frequency? So, stuff? so for basically for every data set, uh, there is built-in functionality that uh, allows to track downloads amount. And, oh, uh, yeah. So. Um, if you'll click on, uh, if you'll open first page, you, you can find uh, uh, statistics uh, mm -hmm. uh, on top. And currently we have like 500 downloads of data set. But of course, because uh, now we enabled uh, previewers, so it will be less downloads, but, but more views, I would say. Right, okay. Thanks, thanks, Lava. And also we have a plan actually to install um, some kind of metrics and uh, we have a few candidates uh, provided by uh, Dataverse community itself and uh, we just need to uh, run it as separate service. Right, okay, okay. Awesome. Um, yeah, and the uh, la last thing, uh, I did a yeah. presentation of uh, uh, Coronavai um, kind of helicopter view. Uh, and uh, yeah, I just uh, published on, on Slack uh, link. Uh, yeah, I saw that. Yeah. So if anyone is interested, uh, interested to know what actually we do uh, from the point of view of labs and uh, infrastructure and data management, I tried uh, to make a story and uh, yeah, to actually to present what, what we already have and uh, what is our final goal. So I hope it can be uh, much more clear after you will watch this video. Awesome. Thanks a lot. So I'm looking forward to check it out. Yeah, you're welcome. All right. Um, I don't think we have any anyone else representing any of the um, groups as such, but uh, for anyone who has any updates they'd like to share who's on the call, um, now would be a good time. Uh, if not, any other thoughts, comments, suggestions from anyone? All right then, I guess that was a quick call. Uh, Tyler Boris, who just joined, hi there. Uh, we had a few updates from Slava, uh, but otherwise short call today. Anything you guys wanna add? Um, no, I've just been watching Slava's call 
Oh, that he's done this presentation. So no, I don't really have a lot to say. Not right now, anyway. He's got a <laughs> okay. <laughs> I hope it was clear. <laughs> really enjoyed it, but um, yeah, yeah we, we need to, we need to work on your presentation skills. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you know, uh, the challenge is, uh, I would say it's very clear uh, because we have artificial intelligence and uh, machine learning and uh, it's something that people don't understand how it can support uh, medical experts. So I've tried uh, to do my best actually to explain uh, the, uh, how to get credibility and uh, how to get everybody just from different communities uh, in, in one uh, big collaboration and uh, yeah, just, just watch it until the end, until you will get it, I think. I'm, I'm literally like the, last, the question and answer bit at the end. I've watched most of it already. But yeah, I'm, okay. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just, I've been watching that. Oh, missed the call. I'll go see what's going on there. But no, it's fine. Um, anything, I'll, I'll read through reports, see if there's anything interesting. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I'm All right, then. Uh, thanks, everyone for joining. Uh, have a good rest of your day. Bye for now. Okay. See you. Yeah. Have a good day.